Have you ever wondered how a certain streamer that you've encountered on Twitch has hundreds of viewers or even thousands, but only like a couple of people or just the bot is talking in the chat? And you're honestly wondering what is going on? Well, I wanted to make this video to show people that there is an extension out there that you can easily put into your browser, which shows you if the streamer is embedding or not. Well, it doesn't explicitly say whether they're embedding, it just shows the actual number of people in their chat versus the number that everyone else sees. Embedding, in case you didn't know, is when a person's stream is on a website outside of Twitch and anyone who is on that website browsing or whatever actually counts as a viewer on their Twitch page. And sometimes the person who's browsing on that website doesn't even know that there's even a stream on the website. The stream could be a one by one pixel, very tiny, and the volume at the lowest possible volume so that they have no idea. Okay, so here is the extension. It's called Twitch Enhancer. So here, if we scroll down, we see the overview and it has a, some pretty cool features, but the really important feature that I'm talking about in this video is the chatters count right here. From now on, you will know if the streamer has fake viewers because it will tell you the actual amount of people in their stream chat. All right, so how to put it on is really simple. You just click add to Chrome, add extension. Boom, it's been added. And I'll be providing this extension in a link below underneath the video. So you can easily grab it and just put it on your browser. And now as a sample, we will go into Twitch. Now that we're on Twitch, we can find a couple of people who have quite sussy numbers. Okay, so I found a streamer right here. And this is a perfect example, I would say, of someone who looks like they could be embedding because the number in the brackets is basically their actual viewer count. And the number on the left is what you see on Twitch. So whenever the number is doubled or more than what their actual people in chat are, I start to think that it does look a little bit suspicious and that they could be embedding. Now, I do want to put a disclaimer. Not everyone who has these strange numbers could be embedding. So there are other things to consider, like they could have just gotten raided or hosted or they're presented on the front page. And that's why they have a lot of viewers compared to actual people in their chat. But what you could do is monitor them for like a couple of days. And if it keeps showing that they have double or triple the amount of people in their chat, then that is probably an obvious tell that they are embedding. And that's how I gauge it. And so we have another example here of a massive streamer, but you can clearly see that there's only a 200 viewer difference. And I think that this person is legit because it isn't double the amount of people in their chat. So give or take, it all depends on the amount of people in the stream. If someone has 10,000 viewers and there's like a 400 difference. Yeah, I mean, like this is a big streamer. They could be getting hosted by many other streamers. So it does make sense that a big stream would have like a couple of hundred of people off. So I could only find one example currently on Twitch, but um, different times of the day, I have seen certain streamers who do probably embed and their numbers have been constantly that way. It wasn't a raid. It wasn't a host. It's very easy to monitor it and see if the numbers are constantly majorly off. But yeah, I'm really glad that I got to make this video. Finally, it's been it's been on my mind for a while. The moment I started seeing Asmongold make videos about Fextra Life and reacting to other people's videos about Fextra Life, I knew, okay, I think there's a lot of people out there who don't know about this extension. And I really, really want to make this video so that they know about this extension and that they could probably pinpoint who is actually embedding, AKA the new view botting. And also something to consider is that these might these might be actual people who are embedding on actual sites that have legit people on these sites. But I think sometimes they could be embedding themselves onto fake sites where the amount of people on that site is fake. I don't know the technical side of it. I'm not like a website programmer or anything like that. I Maybe that's not even possible, but I feel like it's possible to put fake views or fake people on a website for that to count as viewers on someone's stream. 
But because embedding has been allowed on Twitch, a lot of people are actually abusing this feature. So a couple of years ago, when you clicked on a streamer's viewer list, it showed every single person currently watching that stream. So if they had 2000 viewers and you clicked on the viewer list, all 2000 Twitch accounts would more or less be shown unless they weren't currently logged in or didn't have a Twitch account. Nowadays on Twitch, when you click the viewer list, it only shows a handful of randomized people who are currently watching the stream. Because of this new feature, which actually hides the amount of people in the viewer list, it makes it possible for streamers to easily hide if they are embedding. But yeah, the goal of this video was to help bring awareness about this extension so that all of you guys could use it and see what is up on the website, as well as companies or sponsorship deals who make deals with these streamers on Twitch and are potentially getting screwed over because they're probably paying them a lot of money thinking that they have all these real viewers in their chat, but maybe half of them are fake. So if they start seeing this extension and using it for themselves, that would be also very helpful. If you found this video useful, you know exactly what to do. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.